Okay, welcome back. Uh, we're going to do what you should have done is finished up the ears, okay, and um, finish rounding that off in the top, which we just did. And then uh, what we want to do is, you see these areas right here? This goes up a ways up to the back and this here. Okay, they're, they're like the muscles part of the... Um, of the dog, we're going to put those in. So what, it, what we're going to do is we're going to put a line, like so, and a line, a little bit curved out, going up like so. Okay. So what we're going to do, we're going to take our knife, we're going to start one side and the other, just like that. We're going to cut a good portion of this out on that side, and then do the same thing with the other side. It's more like a flat plane carving, I would say, but all right. And we're going to go in here a little bit more. And you just do like a little V cut all the way out. See yeah, how it's starting to shape up? Okay. So, what we want to do is we want to make that more pronounced. So, we're going to do the same thing a V cut. Just like that. All right, that's all that's to it, folks, is making that line like it, like it's there. We can trim some more of this off. I don't think that's trimmed off enough to my liking. It's a little blocky, so we're going to trim some more of this off here at the top. So what we do on this side, you do on the other side, okay, folks? So that just takes some more off here. I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm going to put a stop cut there, a V cut, and I'll work my way around. You can put a line down, but it's hard to get rid of that line once you have it on there. So I just kind of do it at an angle, and then you can backtrack a little bit just like that. See? And then you see how he's starting to shape up. He's a little bit too fat for me, so I'm going to just chop some more of him off here. His back isn't so big. We're going to have to take something off that tail in a little bit here. But you're working everything towards that center line that you see. All right. And then what you're doing here, too, you're, you're scooping it out a little bit. Let me see if I can get a detail knife. You're going to put like a little bit of a stop cut. Well, actually, you're just going to round it out just like so. See how I'm using my finger? my thumb here and then you're just going to back cut it like so like that's part of the head there which is fine you may have to go back and reline that ear a little bit like you see right there all right and that's okay there's nothing wrong with that take that little piece out see how we got that going and you going to chop some of this blockiness off of here And just kind of round it up. So we're working on the neck and the side of the body here. So, you know, folks, I want to encourage you if you're a new carver, you know, I know you're going to maybe look at your piece and say, well, it doesn't look the same. It's not supposed to look the same. It's going to look similar, but it's not supposed to look identical. In fact, I can't make these two look identical either. You know, I do my best to do something similar. You know, and, and you'll have a style of, of completely of your own. Now, see underneath here, underneath the neck. Okay, we're going to trim that out a little bit. Just take your detail knife and, and push it underneath. Go back underneath and just cut it out with, a, with like a stop cut, just like so. Okay? Or you can put a little stop cut there first and then work towards it. So we get a little bit of a... Of a of a thing there of a neck okay so that's that's how that neck is done all right but here we're going to keep going here with the body here and keep working on that I'll work on this belly a little bit 
and I just keep going around until I feel comfortable it's where I want it to be okay and we'll go turn it around we'll do the other side towards the back see we're rounding this off here in the bottom of the leg at the same time so don't let that fool you we're going to take some of that out there see that's going to be rounded automatically with this and just kind of take your time and keep going back and forth take little chips make sure your carving glove is on folks this you know because you can slip pretty easily with this but um, there you go and now I'm going to round this off a little bit more that has a little bit of depth to it that will have a little more of a pot belly in a little bit here we'll get more of a belly as we keep going up this digging this out a little bit further and yeah, you, know, you go as deep as you want really um, you know until it looks right see how we're shaping it now see this it's shaped pretty good all right and we'll get the other half to match that and then uh, we'll start on the legs on the next time around okay bye bye